every year some of the fastest and fittest athletes come together and battle out for top honors and this year was no different as Prince Edward hosted the 2018 edition of its Sprints Challenge competition. Let's go baby! Let's go baby! Let's go baby! Let's go baby! Here at Prince Edward's Prince Challenge, it's been amazing to find other schools coming through to present a challenge for us. It's nice to look at someone and say they're strong or they're fast, but it takes a lot of work. It, a lot of work goes into it, so yes, it's just a lot of work required. I think it's been good. We've been trying our best to keep up, and I think it's been going well. But then we still do need to work, though. We could do a lot better, but for now, I think we're doing well. Athletes just need to, you know, stretch a bit more and to just, you know, just try and focus on the race a bit more. You guys need to train well before the before your races, so you're like in motion already, and just have faith in yourself and in your schools, and then you'll see the results come up. PE and Saints have been putting in a lot of work in the training ground and it's showing dedication. You've got to stay dedicated to your sport. Stay committed as well. Never stop. If you want to reach the top level, the highest level you want to achieve, make sure you keep working and never slack off, never give up. Practice doesn't make perfect. Practice makes permanent. When you come to this battleground, just know that the people you see running have spent months practicing for this day and they will shed blood, sweat and tears from the starting gunshot to the finish line. So we will start with the last position. We had six schools participating. Position six, girls high. On 5th position, we had Peter House with 79 points. 4th position, we had Gateway with 85 points. 3rd position, Sudbury with 100. 2nd position, Arundel with triple one. And I'll leave you to guess the winners of the 2018 Sprints Challenge. Uh, Chizzy Pitti with 120 points. Captain, please come through. Again, we're starting with position number six, Sudbury with a total of 62 points. Position number five, Gateway with 71 points. Position number four, St. John's College, 85 points. Position number three, Peterhouse with a total of 100 points. In second position, St. George's College with triple one. And the winners of the 2018 edition of the Prince Edward Sprints challenge our Prince Edward School with a total of 138 points. Um, the Sprints challenge this year went on well. I'm happy and thank God for the rain that he stopped for, for us to get our event. Uh, the level of competition was, was superb. Uh, Sudbury came up, fired up. Uh, TCBT, Arendelle always expected to come up, fired up. For you to be to be the best, you need to train harder and also know your times. Work with times. Don't just do things haphazardly. But you need to work with times and good diet as well. Okay. Yep. Uh, lastly, I want to thank the schools that came through to, um, to, our, face, to our event. Uh, thanks to the girls' schools that came through, the boys' schools. Big up to the support that you've always been giving us and to the parents and our guest of honor, Miss Anna Muguni, uh, the Zoka Chief Executive. I just want to thank you for coming through to, to the occasion. And uh, also thank God for giving us a good weather.